Hi, my name's Becky Jerrams. I'm a singer-songwriter from Portsmouth. And I'm Chris Wortley. I'm a songwriter. I don't perform. I'm a songwriter uh, from Southampton. We were approached by Matt Harrison, the director of Son of Perdition, about writing the theme song for his movie. Um, he first of all asked me if I had anything in my back catalogue that might fit the movie, um, but when I couldn't really find anything that fit the exact scenes, we decided that um, to suggest that perhaps we write something specifically for the movie. And then you asked me. And then I asked my friend Chris if he would want to help me write it and produce for me. Which sounded good to me, so we got together. We, we quite often write together anyway, so we knew we, that would work well. But this was a, a new challenge to write a song to a very specific brief, to, to, to match the movie, to match the scene. That was that was new and that was great fun. I think we, we, we kind of approached it not that differently from how we write other songs, which is um, we sort of get a vibe going first, a sort of feel for it. Uh, sort of drums and chords and, and a feel for the music before we start working on a melody and lyrics and things. So we did that. Um, but but obviously it had to be a 50s kind of vibe. And we wanted to make sure that it didn't sound too modern um, and that yes. the production of it had that kind of retro 50s sound. We researched um, the kind of production sounds of other songs from the era and we had a look at the Renettes mm -hmm. and the way that they recorded their harmonies and whether they had doubles or just a single, uh, what's the word? Lead. Whether they had just a single lead <laughs> and we tried to emulate um, the way that the songs went back in the day. We had the script beforehand, so mm -hmm. we knew the characters and the dialogue and the way that the film was going to go. So we really wanted to foreshadow that a little bit with our lyrics. On the surface, they sound very sweet, like a 1950s love song about dreaming, um, holding your lover. But when you sort of scratch below the surface of the verse lyrics, it starts to get a little bit sinister. Um, and matching with the imagery in the film, we're hoping they all kind of give that yes. sinister Hid tone. Hidden darkness. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Hidden, um, hidden spiciness. <laughs> <laughs>